Hi everyone. And today I want to talk about heaven on earth because I can see and everyone can see that there's hell on earth right now. Um, the unemployment, the the increasing unemployment, the um, the lockdowns, um, the deaths, and I can see also in my process it is my individual process that what's coming out is the hell in me plus the hell in in what is going on on earth you know this is the time to talk about this because when we see the hell in us and the hell in this society that we live in that's the time we can talk about heaven because to talk about heaven we, we've got to talk about the hell part of ourselves and the hell on earth And of course, um, now everyone can relate to this because everyone is in the same boat. The whole world is experiencing um, a lot of de deaths, a lot of unemployment, suffering. So, We have to um, really create a blueprint. It's time for us to create um, a blueprint of this new world because it is it is something that each of us um deep within our being this is something we want we all want um, some may say uh you know i'm busy surviving but deep within them there is this point of let, let's look at what is really needed to be able to bridge a haven here on earth you know because enough is enough I mean this is it this is the bottom this is not gonna go uh, lower this is the lowest point you know this is um, where we spring back and it's it's really uh, just us using our common sense because it's it's not a big deal. The, the world is organized. It's got a system going. So identifying what's wrong in these different systems and what is causing problem, why, and then creating or rewriting the system N not 
in a in our mind but for real let's do this i mean there are groups i belong to that that are really into this and of course uh, it, all of us belong to one group and it's the group called life or team life you know so this is something that we need to talk about this is this should be uh, the Facebook live of everyone it should, we should all talk about this um, one one group um, was talking about the vision the vision their vision and, and, and I listened to it and I realized it's really time this is the time we should all talk about this because if we don't talk about this guess what we will talk about we will talk about the problems and when we talk about problems it's not going to go anywhere let's talk about the solutions but first before the solutions we've got to pinpoint the problems in each system I can just look at the education system right now and that is where we all converge because um, to be in the system we need to and we are in a system we need to be taught how to speak how to write so it's we're facing the education system right here and that is where we're going to start to change the world we've got to change the way um, we understand or learn things, learn words. Um, this is a world that is made out of information. This is the, the basic stuff that we talk about, we write about, you know. So let's do that. Let's, um, let's create, create a blueprint for how this world should change that. So, so that we are not consumed about thinking about the problem. We can just pinpoint the problem, you know. We, we need to really um, look at the real problem. Uh, and that's the first step. But then when you really look at the problem as what it is without uh, magnifying it or making it less then the solution is right there within the problem is the solution so let's do that and I want to share with you also the fact that we are uh, we have the tools to spearhead or to catalyze the change in in the individual um 
and we have this tool that we use and there are already a lot of testimonials that talk about the our successes and I haven't um, talk to you about my one but I use this every day I use these tools and and there are baby tools that appeared out of these two main tools that we use so we, we can also create a business that too is principle centered or principle driven to create a world that is best for everyone and where our starting point is not just to survive for for ourselves and for our families but also for all of us to survive and create some um, and create communities that will contribute to a world change well first think but first things first is for us to have a tool that we can use daily to support us because as we can see there are a lot of environmental changes happening and our survival is being challenged by this so we need that stable footing to be able to really look at the problem and implement the solutions. So click on the link and um, get a presentation because this is going to be it. This is it. Um, because the success testimonials or success stories are just so many to ignore we can't ignore them anymore i mean um the ones using these tools are really uh, getting the results that that are needed to be able to um, spearhead this change within ourselves and I'm not talking about the ideas of grandeur but I'm talking about the really facing facing the problems within our own lives and facing the problems in this world we need strength courage um, stability and and for us to be resilient and strong to to be able to stand up and stand in the platform to uh, or for the that which is best for all of us.